right, folks, here we are. What is the project now, Xander? <laughs> yeah. Mm hmm. So, we've got a, uh, it's winter. Uh, this is what we've got right now for the boots. Stephanie was supposed to remove this table last night. So we've got shoes up there so that uh, blue cheese doesn't chew on them. Anyhow, we're going to build a bench. A mud, mud room bench. So you can come in, sit down, and take your boots off without tracking them through the house. It's gonna be a bench from roughly this trim to this trim over here. Uh, we're gonna start off phase one will just be the bench. And then we'll probably add some cubby holes up towards the top uh, for other things and some other hooks for coats. The hooks that we have on here right now, that's what holds our gear. Uh, probably put hats and stuff right there where you sit and then the long coats will be like on the side or something. All right? All right? All right. All right, folks. This right here, this wood right here is the, uh, about the remainder of what we used on the deck project. Uh, I think these are 2x10s. They may be even 2x12s. Uh, no, they're 2x10s. They're 2x10s. All right. So we're going to use the rest of this for the bench, mud bench. Okay. We're going to take, it's going to be too wide. So I need to, uh, it's 62, my uh, bench is going to be 62 inches long. So I need to cut four of these at 62 inches. The height of this bench is going to be 18 inches. So whatever the thickness of two of these minus uh, 18 minus those will give us the height of those boards. So first things first, I got to cut four of these at 62 inches. folks that's it for the day I gotta get ready for work clean up so I got all the wood cut I've got uh, four 62 inches and then I've got eight 14 and a half inches that'll make the bench 18 inches high all right so I got four for the ends and then another four for dividers in the bottom where our shoes and boots will go. Well, these have got a little bit of wetness on them, some ice. I'm gonna let them sit outside here in the sun and dry. We'll come back through and sand them up, clean them up. Probably take them inside where the floor is nice and flat. That's where it's gonna be anyhow. Line it up and screw it together. And then we'll paint it. All right, so it's been a couple days. These boards have been out drying. In the meantime, I've been a little busy. So I'm going to, some of these boards have like some concrete residue on them. I'm gonna use a grinder to take that off and then I'll come back through with the sander and sand it. 
I'm not going for super smooth. I just want to get some of the rough, rough areas out. We want this to look uh, antique-ish, barnwood-ish, rustic. So we're not going for perfected, milled, smooth boards. Just clean up anything that's going to come loose during painting and setting on. Okay? go back over this after we build it and wherever you would sit I would kind of round it out smooth it out make sure you don't get any splinters in your butt you get the idea all right here's what we have we've got four long boards four 62 inches we've got eight short ones I think they were 14 and a half that'll make the bench 18 inches tall. I do not have the wood cut to connect them. Essentially what we're doing is building two rectangles and I will cut after we get them built and painted. I will make some connecting boards to connect these boards, these rectangles. Yes, that's what I was thinking too. Yes, right, okay. So, Sander and I are going to get these built, and then they'll smooth them out and paint them. Okay? Okay. Anything else you got to say? Hey, anything else? I guess that's it. Alright, here's what we're looking at. This is the gist, these aren't centered, but we're gonna square this up and uh, screw those in. Then we're gonna measure and get these centered. That'll give us three cubby holes. And we're gonna make two of these. You ready? Hand me the drill. Hand me the drill. Thank you. Got your glasses on? Glasses on. Oh. Ah. Make sure it's straight. Good job. High five. High five. Here. Fist bump. Fist bump. Fist bump. Fist bump. Whatever. Alright folks, so this is the gist of it for this part. So we got two things. And I gotta take some wood and cut it. And connect the two so it's one piece. And mom and Brianna are gonna paint it. And that's it. This, this guy's bedtime. He worked hard today. Uh-huh. All right. Tell everybody bye. I love you. Bye. All right, folks, that's it for phase one. It's painted. I painted it today. So the next phase, we're gonna build some cubbies about right here and right here, and this is gonna have a cushion on it. And then we'll trim this out with some white trim and boots. And then I'll put some uh, conveyor belt in the bottoms so they don't get wet. And we'll 
It will be complete. That will be phase two. Say bye. 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 Get out of the way. Bye. Bye. Bye.